are here in the free country of Miami. You can gauge the excitement here. It's never been like this before. It's like Woodstock, that's what I'm calling it. It's Woodstock for Bitcoin. Who is Satoshi Nakamoto? I can't say, I know, but I can't say. Uh, it's not Kevin, it's probably the CIA. What does hodl mean? I'm hodling her. No, no, it's called hodling, it's fine. It means don't sell. Where it started was with this guy who got drunk, he mistyped hold. What about FUD? Uh, that's fear, uncertainty, and doubt, and we have none of that here. Like Elon Musk are selling that by the gallon, trying to get people to dump yeah. out of their crypto. Yeah, yeah. Here's what you really want to learn about, diamond hands. During a crash, do you stack or smash? No, you gotta, you gotta load up on every correction. You gotta think long term here. This is real estate. And when there's a crash, you're down 38%, you buy more. That's the way you gotta look at it. So you bought more? Yeah, of course. I'm, I'm keeping it at a 3% weighting in my mandates. That's the first time I've got that much. I could go to 5%, I have gold at 5%, so I'm, you know, I'm just building, building, building. I buy more when I realize that I've already got enough to take care of my family and my capital calls. Once they're all covered, then, then I go, what else is left? All into Bitcoin. So is Bitcoin gonna ever hit one million? Oh, way past. My prediction is 250,000 by the end of 22 or the beginning of 2023. It won't be quite as volatile and it'll be a nice steady upward climb. What institutions want right now is only Bitcoin. They are far behind everybody else that's building up portfolios. They want to own real estate. That's what they want. You're going to be exposed to volatility, but so what? You're exposed to volatility every day if you're in crypto. I want to suck that yield out of the volatility. I want to inhale yield. It's only one in 14 Bitcoin wallets that's owned by a woman. So <laughs> high five for yeah. that. It's the first conference where we're feeling we're safe to go out. We're all vaccinated. It's amazing to get back together with people again. I love this. I love all these Bitcoiners. They understand that Bitcoin represents freedom and trust. You know, Miami, this is where it all starts. It's always Miami first. We were both at Carbone last week. <laughs> I I'm gonna be there again tonight. I'm gonna rename it Bitcoin Steak. <laughs> and that wine list is pretty killer too. Yeah. Oh, they do need his wine and my wine. They need oh, yeah. Chenet Rosé. Oh, they... It's just won its fifth award. Walla Walla, Cabernet Sauvignon. It's a gift to John, I'm giving it to him.